list focuses narrowly on the best product in each smart home subcategory. If you want to know the best smart thermostat or the best smart lighting kit, regardless of which voice platforms support them, we have you covered. What this list is not is a roadmap for a single, coherent smart home installation, you won't get far trying to pair an Amazon smart speaker with a Google smart display. Amazon's fourth-gen Echo is still impressive well over a year after its initial launch, and even if you pay its full dollar $100 price, you can often find it on sale if you keep an eye out. Between its new sphere-like profile, powerful sound output, and a few forward-looking features, the Echo is still king of the countertop. Google's Nest audio speaker, which also launched in 2020, is a solid competitor with the Echo, and Apple's recent HomePod mini plays well in the Apple sandbox, but Amazon wins out in two key categories. Its speaker is far more powerful, the bass is particularly impressive, and it features a built-in Zigbee receiver and Amazon Sidewalk Hub that make connecting devices like light bulbs and locks much more seamless and reliable. Meanwhile, Alexa and Google Assistant are pretty much at parity right now. While Amazon boasts about more skills and support for more third-party devices for its voice assistant, the numbers for Google Assistant also land in the tens of thousands, meaning you really don't miss out on anything significant either way. Google's Nest Mini Smart Speaker isn't as powerful as the new Echo, obviously, but it's a great budget-friendly option for Google users. The audio quality in the Nest Mini is respectable, given its price and profile. It also has a wall-mounting notch on the underside, if that's what you're into. An interesting presence detection method that uses the speaker and microphone to determine your proximity to the Nest Mini helps it trigger LED indicators that help you make better sense of the otherwise obscured physical volume controls. That's all fine, but the thing that puts the Nest Mini over the top is the machine learning chip embedded inside the tiny speaker. With that chip, Google says, the Nest Mini can learn what commands you give to it most often, and it will then begin to process those commands locally rather than on Google's servers. Anything that helps to keep control of your smart home inside your home is worthwhile. Letting you continue to issue certain voice commands even if the internet goes out, and improved response times are great too. While the Nest Mini doesn't have the audio output jack that allows you to connect Echo Dots to better quality speakers, it's still one of our favorite devices, particularly for people who already use Google services like Gmail and Calendar with any regularity. Amazon may have introduced the smart display with the Echo Show, but Google refined the concept with the Nest Hub, formerly the Home Hub, both in terms of its design and in the way it leverages its voice assistant. Now there's a second-gen model, released in 2021, with a lower price and more features. You get the same Google Assistant features in the Nest Hub that you get with the Google Home Speaker line, along with a screen interface that gives you just the right amount of visual feedback. It will show you your spoken commands so you know Google heard you correctly, it can deftly walk you through a recipe from popular cooking websites, and it works seamlessly with Google-supported smart home cameras and video doorbells to display their camera feeds on-screen. Google's Soli is also on board for sleep sensing and quick gestures like pausing media with an air tap in front of the display. Amazon's Mintier Smart Display is the best one in its line. For $130, the Echo Show 8 has great audio quality, a highly visible screen, and a convincing nod to privacy with a physical shutter you can slide over its camera. The second generation of the device launched in 2021, and honed many of the features that earned the first edition in Editor's Choice Award. We still like the interface better on the Google Nest Hub and Nest Hub Max, but for those of you who are committed to an Alexa-only ecosystem, the Echo Show 8 is the best smart display for the price. Wi-Fi is everything, particularly once you start spreading things like smart speakers, smart lights, smart plugs, and smart all else from room to room. After all, those connected doodads won't do you much good if they can't, you know, connect. That's why a mesh router that's built to spread a strong, speedy signal throughout your house might make for a particularly smart upgrade, especially if you're living in a big home. Of the ones we've tested, 
we think the Nest Wi-Fi is the smartest pick. At $269, the two-piece starter kit was able to fill the 5,800-square-foot smart home with decent signal strength, and it never once dropped our connection as we moved around conducting speed test after speed test. On top of that, the range extender doubles as a smart speaker, so as you spread a reliable connection from room to room, you'll be spreading Google Assistant's footprint in your home with it. Alexa, as always Google Assistant, as always Samsung Smartphones. Okay, so in the app itself, it will show schedule. So schedule, you can schedule a certain time you want the gadget to go on and off. Uh, it has a way as well. Um, the way is more like if you go on holiday and uh, you have it plugged into a lamp and it will randomly pick a time uh, to go on and off. Uh, just to show you.